Hey, what's going on everybody? Today we're going to be playing Dungeons of Hittenberg. This is a game where you play as a girl with a sword and you go through the Dungeons of Hittenberg. It's a new indie game that just dropped with a cool art style and uh, has RPG elements to it. So I thought, why not? Let's give it a shot. It's free on Game Pass if you want to check it out yourself. But without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. When I was five, my parents took me to a botanical garden, an hour's drive from Vina. Right in the middle of it, there was a fenced off cave. Twenty years later, I still remember it vividly. Because a witch dwelled there. Okay. My dad laughed and said my imagination was playing tricks on me. My witch was just a shadow. But no matter what he said, I would not be convinced. The cave was special. When I was a kid, every new place we went to was special. Everything had this wild sense of mystery and adventure. I miss that. So, first time Slayer, or have you stayed with us before? Lately, nothing in my life has felt particularly adventurous. Long days at the office bleeding to one another, short weekends spent on the couch, doing nothing but recovering from work stress. If this is your first time, you must see our spire recently reopened. That's going to change you, and there's no place in the world more special than Hittenberg. Twenty-five magical dungeons right in the middle of the Alps. The media called it an elaborate hoax at first, then a mass hallucination. But here we are, and this is real. This is where I'll be staying for the next few weeks. This is where I don't have to be a junior at a law firm for a little while. I should go check in. Alright. I should go check into my gas house. Okay, I got you. I just want to look around a little bit. Like I said, it has a really cool art style to it. Alright, let's go ahead and just go right in. Just wanted to check out the place. The air inside the guest house smells of heavy wood. There's a hint of fur scent scented air freshener. I'm instantly taken back to every skiing holiday I've had as a kid. Welcome to Hittenberg, Fraulein Louisa Doyfer. Ah, of course, room 102. My phone doesn't get any reception here. Will it work in my room? Ah, uh, you did get the brochure, right? There's no cell reception around Hinterberg, no internet either, I'm afraid. A side effect of the magic. Good, I won't be reading my work emails here. We're still preparing your room for Arlene Norfer. It should be about another half hour. Actually, I can't wait to get out there and start slaying monsters. What a good place to go. Oh, very well. Let, my phone, let me phone Klaus. He's our resident trainer. He'll take you to the beginner's dungeon. Uh, sure, let's go ahead and go to the beginner's one. That sounds great. We call tourist info. I have this sorted for you in a minute. Claus will be waiting for you at the tourist info. Let me mark his location on the map for you. Okay. Where are we at on the map? Oh, I see us. We're right over here. So we got a good little ways to get to him. Sounds good. Fastest way is through there. Just take the path to the right. You'll be there in no time. Nice of Claus to make an appointment on such short notice. Have a lovely stay for Arlene. Let's get it then. Is there no jump button? I like, like, how you, as you keep moving. Okay, I got you, chick. Let's just take the path down. Okay, I got you. Like, as you're moving, you start off slow, and then she progressively gets faster. I think that's pretty neat. Everybody else is so dull. I'm the only one that's got some color to me. Oh, never mind. He does. Brory Louisa, right? How do you do? I'm Klaus. Klaus Hornbacher. About as famous as an alpinist gets. Used to have a TV segment on an unappreciated hiking trails. On unappreciated hiking trails. Let's get started. Nice to meet you. Can we get started? All right. We're going to take it nice and slow today, okay? I'll be right behind you, but I need you alert and aware of your surroundings. No matter what they say in the brochure, this is a dangerous sport. Are we clear on that? Yes, Crystal. Good, that's what I wanted to hear. Our first dungeon is on Empress Sissy Promenade. 
There's going to be a couple of monsters before we get to the portal. Ready to go in? Let's go. <laughs> so they look at this as like hunting or whatever. It's kind of crazy work, I'm not going to lie. I'm about to dip on him. He can't even keep up. Oh, that's the monsters right there. Listen, these kobolds will attack you as soon as you get close enough. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll be here spotting you. Any questions? Let's do this. I ain't got no questions. I'm ready. Let's fight some stuff. Good. Let's see how you handle a sword. X is a light attack. Heavy attack is Y. Sweet. Let's get it, girl. Ooh. Oh. I just smoked all my hits. I can lie, my reach is kind of weak. He's running. Man, let you get away. Nicely done. It's good to see you can handle yourself. Let's move on, all right? They dropped some stuff. A monster tooth. Two monster tooth. See these blobs of goo? These refill your health. Hit them with your sword, you'll feel the effects immediately. Come across proto monster blobs like these, hitting them with your sword or magic. Okay, just slap them there. HP and MP refilled, health points and mana points. Word of advice most first timers just keep wailing on these creatures till they plop. Try practicing your dodge while you fight them, it'll be useful down the road. But what time dodge keeps you out of the hospital? You know, I'm not gonna lie. I, I always like games that that like keep everything the same. Like this one right here, the dodge is B. Anytime else, like a game that's trying to be different, make A the dodge or something. I don't like that. Very good, Louisa. A lot of new slayers forget how important the basics are once they learn their first magic spells. But your physical attacks and dodge and monster attacks will always be essential. Keep practicing them. I just don't like when they try and switch up stuff. Like when they make A the dodge, when B's usually dodge for everything. Like, if you're gonna make a fighting game, I hate to say it, but just make it the same like with uh, Dark Souls and them. Well, you look at that, a treasure chest. Neat. Nice, all mine. What are you waiting for? Go on, open it. Let's check it out now. Not bad, Five, 500 Hinter Bucks. Hinter Bucks, you don't use Euros here. Not for potions, slinger, and such. Mayor Wagner has introduced her own currency to level the playing field for all adventurers who stay with us. Don't worry, the restaurants still happily take credit cards. Let's move on. The dungeon is right around the corner. I want to know what my uh, my magic, uh, whatever it is, my spell is. This is it. Your first dungeon portal. I'll go in right behind you. You got your dungeon stamp book, right? Your goal is to reach the exit and get your stamp. I can't stress this enough. Once you reach the exit, exit get your book stamped. The exit portal won't activate until you do. Any questions? Uh, I'll go in. I'm going in. All right. Once you're through, I'll go as, go as well. All right. Well, we don't need anything because we're good to go. And otherworldly heat emanates from the portal. Am I really ready to do this? Into the dungeon. This is like a, uh, uh, what's that anime called? Solo leveling. That's what it reminds me of. <laughs> this is something else, all right. To think that just yesterday I was sitting at my office desk wanting so much, wanting so much to be somewhere different, be somewhere different. This is as different as it could ever get. It's close to coming. It's been a while now. Maybe I should go have a look around on my own. Yeah, we don't worry about buddy. She automatically climbs up. Yeah. Okay. I need a jump, man. Louisa, here. Y'all right, the dungeon looks different from normal. The portal didn't spit me out in the usual place either. 
You'll be careful, okay? Uh, I'll try to meet you further up ahead. That's fine. You ain't see what I was just doing to these guys? Let's explore up here first. Hello there, chick. Let's see what we got going on. Uh, coin, beginner's dungeon. Shiny. Oh, wait, it just said A somewhere. What was that for? I thought it said A. Maybe I was tripping. Target lodge, target switch. I got that out there. Are these guys new? Like, what are these guys got? Oh, these are like range guys. We're dicing these dudes up. I wonder if we I wonder if we sell these monsters teeth. Can we climb up there? Nah. Is that what we about to fight? Oh my gosh. But it right there look like a beast. But we haven't even been touched yet, so we ain't been needing no help. Over here, still found a way to get down to you. There's a couple of jumps here, but you'll be able to handle those no problem. Uh, L and A climb from ledge to ledge. Simply run over ledge to jump. Louis will hold on to any ledge within reach. From there, you can climb from ledge to ledge. Okay. Oh, okay, I saw what it says. Climb down is A. Okay, so she jumps like that. Not mad about it. Uh-oh. -uh. I don't know if that's any good. Did you feel that? The ground's shaking. This doesn't feel right. We should press on. Be careful, okay? So this is supposed to be my beginning dungeon. They about to throw me into something crazy. Oh, buddy, right here looks legit. Ooh, let me dodge. What did he just hit me with? Nah, you ain't getting away. Bro, I didn't hit him. Uh-oh, more of them. Oh, there's these guys. Bro, this chick must have been like grinding them. Uh, she, she had to have done this before. There's no way she's just out here doing this. Jump up. I can't jump up. Can't jump up or am I not going the right way or something? I need to hit these things. Oh, that's what it was. These things were holding the boat. Another chest. Pop it out. Let's check what we got. Some more hinder or whatever. Hinder bucks. Okay, we gotta get up there. Dang, buddy, they are literally... They're stacking me up. I'm about to have some nice weapons. I wonder if I could change my gear to like get it to have a helmet on or something. I think that'd be pretty neat. Have me a little fit on. Get rid of you. Uh, go ahead and jump to you. Feel like you'll be the quickest. Jump up. Down. Let's see what we got. Oh, we get like a big boss at the end of every dungeon. I like when it's like that. Now, I hope it's like one of these guys we're looking at, like the old homie right here. Big, big goat. Big long neck goat. Can we get him? Uh. So my thing is, is this like taking the real world and making it something? Or how does this work? 
Hey, over here. I can't get to you from here. You have to make it out. Make it on your own. Hurry, okay? I don't like these earthquakes one bit. Maybe it's a giant monster we about to have to fight. Minor Krampus, tentacled art kill at the beginning of the game. Alright. How do we damage this guy? Oh, we gotta drop the things on top of him, I see now. Jump across, chick. Get across. Watch out. Ain't no way they can reach me. Alright, we're not that thing down. On to the next. Minor cramp. Wait, are we doing damage to him when we hit the thing? Oh no, he only has like. Ugh. Swing. Get up there. Get up there. Oh my gosh. Alright, he's done for where we got him. Slap it. Oh. Louisa. You're moving right now. Snap out of it. This whole place is it's coming down. Go, go. Chicky, you, you gotta run faster than this. She, she is supposed to be running faster than this. She is not. This is not her usual speed. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Jump. Jump. Get out of here, go! Your stamp book, the dungeon won't let you uh, out without a stamp. Oh my gosh, give me your stamp book now. Why am I crouching? Alright, well we just got that one. Complete the beginner dungeon. Uh, yeah, why not? Yeah, let's save. Goodness, Fraulein, you gave us all quite the scare. Where am I? Where am I? Your room. I was watching here after the earthquake. Brought the doctor as well. She'll give you a good check. But said you'd be fine. I'll let you get settled in, Fraulein. Do call reception if there's anything you need. She must have got whooped upside the head. Day one in the afternoon. Oh, it's evening now. News anchor and a local news a minor earthquake was registered in the vigil of Hinderburg this afternoon. Hinderburg is well known as a hot spot of magic ever since its 25 dungeons appeared just over three years ago. Mayor Corin Wagner gave the following statement earlier tonight. My experts have assessed the situation and everything is fine, really. The ground shook a little short, unusual things happen in Hinderburg every day. We're straight to access some of our dungeons while we assess the situation, but so far it appears there's no property damage and nobody got hurt. Is that me? There's no way I'm going to sleep tonight. I close my eyes and I see the ground crumbling beneath me, and I'm running for my life. I need a drink, I need a train ticket, and I need to work at a law firm and be a normal person. Girl, you just killed a whole demon boss. Why are you acting like that? Even the air is, is nice and fresh. The wind carries the roaring songs of drunk adventurers. How they can go straight from mortal danger to boarding is beyond me. Rough first day. Let's say yeah. You could say so. I've seen you stare on a dozen first timers. I always say the same thing. This was a mistake. I was looking forward to this. I was so looking forward to my holiday here. I don't know what I was thinking. How is any of this even legal? 
Brings in the big bucks, that's how. You don't mind if I see it. So you were in a dungeon right when the earthquake hit. Well, talk about a bad first day. Where were you? Where were you when it happened? I was up on Dopper Kogo. It was quite a shake. So you're not the type who thinks they're invincible and you don't like someone. You don't look like someone who, who does this kind of thing for social media clout. What exactly did you think you were going to find here? Um... I was stuck in a rut. You ever feel like you've ever been doing the smart thing in all your life? And it's getting you nowhere? Nah, I can't say that's me. Me, I just kept hearing about this place and thought this is a big deal. They get turned into a theme park and they like... Theme park all they like, but magic in our lifetime, that's huge. I like to be where huge things happen. Look, tomorrow you're going to learn your first spells. Do at least that before you go home. There's something primal about engaging with magic. It's synergy. No offense, but you look like you can use some centering. Give it another day or two. Believe me, you're missing out if you don't. Alright. I guess we're going to stick around for a little bit longer. Day one night. Day two morning. Slept deeply tonight, deeper than in a long time. Usually my dreams are about me being me, me at a university, me at the office, me listening to my flatmate Carol going on about her day. Tonight I didn't dream at all, I was just not there, I feel so rested. I bet, just sitting around in the office all day, man. I booked this, I paid for it, some part of me thought I needed it. I'm going to listen to this part of me for a change, see what comes of it. But look who hasn't packed her bags yet. That's why I'm not going back to being a lawyer for a little longer. Glad to hear it. There's a dungeon up on Dober Coggle that's perfect for the first time spell casting. Let's, let me mark it on your map. Take the cable car up to the mountain, then it's a short hike. Couple monsters, a few puzzles, nothing you can't handle. You let me know how it goes, yeah? Where do you want to go today? We can go to Dober Coggle. Uh, so we can go to some crazy stuff. Well, obviously we're gonna go to the first one. Yes. Day two noon. How many days do we have here? So there's du 25 dungeons in total. So we gotta do all those dungeons before we can do anything. Unlock new fast travel point mountain station. What's this? Some trash? Okay. I already completed three of the seven dungeons on Dober Cargo. I'm hoping to find a fourth today. Kitty land? Well, well met, Slayer. Welcome to Dober, Dober Cargo, where the Tatsil Worm burrows. Uh. What is this place? What exactly is this place? This is our kids area. Never too early to start training if you want to be a pro. People take their families here. I know, isn't it great? Fresh mountain air, physical exercise, and the little ones get so excited when they see a perched. Wait, is this your first day? Second day, please. Second, I did the beginner dungeon yesterday. Whoa, so you haven't done any spell casting yet. This is so exciting. You have to head down that trail. It's a really short hike into the skill shrine. Thanks. I'll do that. Hey, if it's, if this is your first day up here, let me give you a couple of a couple of my health potions. I'll be working all day anyways. Okay, we got three of them. This screen you can sign potions to quick slots. There are three quick slots available. Uh, we're gonna do it in the first one. Potion I slotted in slot one. You can use these at any time during combat or not. Close the window. Have fun. Yeah, this is going to be so cool. Sweet. Finally enter the abandoned mine shaft dungeon. There's a cow blocking this way. Two cows. Best to leave these cows alone. I was about to slap them too. Not gonna lie. Can we get up there? Nah. We're about to pick up some more trash. Yeah, trash. It 
Oh, dodge. Nah, we don't cancel that, buddy. We're doing some major damage. 15, I just saw. You look new. Are you heading to the skill shrine? Have fun using magic for the first time. It was one of the best moments of my life. Thanks. Some more trash. Where we go? Abandoned mine shaft is right there. So we need our we need our magic to be able to break those rocks. I say. Recyclable trash this time. Sweet. And old man. Perched pixel nicks. Watch tink. That you get magic skills. Uh, those magic words is that you get your spells or something. What? Ha ha heavens no. Pizzle perched Habaganus. This is the skill shrine, right? I was told to get I'd get some magic spells somewhere around here. It most certainly is. Okay, what should I do? So how do I use this? Patience, my young friend. Uh, what are you doing here? Uh, prodding the shrine. Prodding. That's what we do in science. Uh, well, when we don't quite have the faintest idea of what's going on, the monsters here all take the shape of alpine mytho mythological creatures. So I'm shouting their names at the top of my lungs to see if that does anything at all. What exactly are skill shrines? What do they do? Ah, the shrines. They are points of Nexus Nexuses, where the conduits of magical energy run together and give people spells and whatnot. The spells are different in every area around Hiddenburg, and they only work in the area where you receive them. This shrine, for instance, for instance, it will give you magic spells that you can only use on Dover Kogo. Still, again, I'm supposed to pick up spells from the from this thing. Oh, that part's quite simple. You want to position yourself two to three meters from the shrine. You gaze at it deeply as you would into an abyss. You focus, and then it just happens. That's it. It just. Got it, I guess. Magic skill wrecking ball. Alright. A range skill ball and chain. Yes, it just happens. Now I suggest you explore your new magic skills. Prod them if you will. They might be useful in ways you never expect. You seem to have all the, this all figured out. Want to come and join me in the dungeon? Ha ha heavens no. My studies aren't nearly advanced enough to attempt a dungeon. Pretty neat. Okay, if a wall looks strange or fragile, try to detonate your record ball close to it. That's like, uh, I thought it wasn't that from Legend of Zelda. Can I use these in bet? Well, obviously the chain. I don't know about a wrecking ball though. Be kind of hard to use in battle, I feel like. Can we drop it on the cows? We can feed the cows. What are we about to feed them? Animal lover. Aren't we the sweetest? Oh, oh, oh. Nah, drop down. Some stuff down here I gotta grab first. All right, now we can jump across. Get it gone. Mountain Lodge. Okay, we can't go to the Mountain Lodge. Cows are all over. Dang, boy. They got all kinds of stuff. I wanna see what I can buy, though. Somebody's sitting right here. Those magic seals sure are something. Hey, have you tried using the ball and chain spell on those green slimy things yet? Yeah, that's what I was about to do. Sounds like you can pull on them. Got it. How cool is that? The coolest. Retract. 
Alright. Alright, we gotta use it. Watch out! Dang, kill, buddy. Oh, I got enough MP. Uh, oh, we get it back from hitting these guys. Gotta use something big. 30 damage? That's crazy. Oop, dodge. Drop it on them. Blow them up. I don't got enough MP. Do some damage to them then. Dodge. Major hit. I didn't hit him. Oh, he died from that. Okay. Find it into the abandoned mine shaft. Any other ones anywhere I can hit? So I can get some of my MP back, my magic points. Then some. Ain't there something I can grab? Yeah, monster tooth. Have a couple of them. All right, back up we go. Okay, hold on. I think I might see what's going on here. Drop it down. Then we'll do this. Pull it down. Detonate. Well, that was smart. Uh, I think I'm going to stay and practice my magic skills some more. Watch you. It's obvious I got to train more before I go into another dungeon. Come on, buddy. You're cooked if you can't do that. That wasn't that complicated, man. Go ahead and climb up there. I don't know what's down there, but I don't want to find out. Oh, I thought we really were getting into like some... What's the name? I'm about to start breaking boxes. We just got no Nonovan uh, Heart. Otherworldly he missed for the portal. Uh, yeah, we're one. Look at all these signs. Tells us how tough the monsters are. We're at level one. All right, let's give this a try. How do we upgrade ourselves, though? Uh, at least gotta be like a level three by now, right? Especially with all the money I done got. Ah, uh, increases your HP. Okay, so you increase by completing dungeons. Let's see, let's see. Let's go. I'm trying to figure out what the monster teeth are for, though. Let's climb down. What is that? We're just gonna ignore him? Oh. Gotta get his work. Gosh. More of them done pulled up. Y'all come over here. Got him. Got him looking good for you, man. They didn't even know. Let's see. We'll take that. Take that. And cancel the skill. Okay, what do we need to do? Oh, okay. Push Buddy here. Right there. Um... We're missing two. Okay, so I need to hit you. And then I need to hit you. Oh, you're just a chest. We'll take you down. Push you right here. Mm, what are we doing? Oh, 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 I see, I see, I see. Y 
Yikes. Oh, hold on. Sweet. Jump across. Oh, girl. Uh, is there a queue for the dungeon? You're standing in line. Uh, actually, I'm working. Thank you. I'm writing a piece on the slang fad for Crooked Magazine. You probably heard of it. Uh, so you're just standing here all afternoon. Uh, I'm, contr con I'm contractually obligated to enter three dungeons. My contract doesn't say anything about actually finishing them. But hey, if you're going deeper, I could uh, really use a first-hand account. Want me to do your work for you? How about you get a quote in the centerpiece of next month's Crooked Sound Wild? I hang out at Krampus Bar most nights, you know, for research, not because I like the place. Stop by if you have time. Alright. I actually like some money, but that's that's cool too. We'll let that slide. I haven't seen if we can travel around in the what's the name though. That's what I'm wondering if we can get around the uh Okay, what are we doing? Oh, it's the blue. I want to know if we can, uh... No! I didn't mean to... This chick jumped off the edge. I didn't even try to. I want to see if we can, uh... Like, check the city out or whatever. Because I still haven't seen to be able to do that yet. It's like it only wanted me to, like, fast travel everywhere. Or go to where it wanted me to, wanted me to go. It wouldn't, like, send, let me walk around. I want to check the whole town out. Every time I get back, it just puts me wherever it wants me. Right, let me check the place out a little bit, man. Uh, that door's locked. Oh, Lord. I just, bro, I just quick scoped them, guys. And there's nothing even here. What was the point of this? I'm missing something. Oh, I can break this water. Small health portion. Potion, small health potion. Take that. Take that. Magic shields. Uh, Sinews are protected by by genera regenerating magic shields intercated by the additional green bar but there he is okay you gotta use magic to deploy him uh, okay. oh it's a long goat it's goat mid oh he just ran me over what the freak what's he about to do what the Hey, buddy is pulling off some crazy tricks right now. Dodge! I can't get away fast enough. All I got for killing him was freaking monster part. I don't know, I feel like I should have got a little bit more out of him. He felt like a boss. What are we doing? Get in? Oh god. I said, obviously the magic ball's got to be heavier than me. Hmm. Okay. What are we to do here? I see that. Can I hit that? Okay. Let's throw this back down again and see what happens. 
There's some up here I'm not seeing. Nah. Oh, oh, oh. I can't hear that. Oh, okay. We're supposed to spin it around. Oh, it's supposed to be... Oh, okay. I don't know we're controlling this thing. Oh, oops. Dude, I keep trying to dodge. Hey, old girl is not dying from that, man. Let's be for real. She look, like she look fine to me. Holy. There's no way, that, nah, there's no way people would actually be surviving this. That's crazy. This is not real. Not some random chick that works at a law, law firm just able to do all this. Let me get some of that. Push the button. What does it do? Okay, so it opens that up. Let me break these so it gives me some stuff. And actually, we need to spun around, don't we? Maybe I'm tripping, I don't know. Oh, oh, okay, I think I see what's going on here. I think I have to connect it all the way through. You can't get in right there, though? What am I... I'm missing something somewhere. I can't get in right here. Let's just get in and see what happens. this run this around this way okay so that got us in right here that needs to be spun like that I guess okay. we need to okay Get off right there. Pop it again. Now we're turned that way. Now we can get back in. Let's take it the other way. Oh, the boss. Hey, I just knocked her down like that. Alright, that twister is on my butt. 
dodge. Ooh. This shit doesn't feel down yet, bro. Ah! Hey, fall down, chick. No way. Ooh. I got no MP. I try to use the bomb. Nah, you're not getting away, buddy. Don't worry about it. Got him. Bet. Bet. Get my stamp. All right, let's get up out of here. Got my stamp and dipping. You don't have to complete a dungeon every day, but I mean, we don't got much time left, I thought. It's the evening now. So, how was it? Uh, dangerous and scary. Did you know people bring their kids here? I thought about that a lot when I was hanging up from a ledge over abyss. And the spell casting? My skin is still tingling. I hope the feeling won't go away anytime soon. I never feel so focused. Like, every piece of me did exactly what I was supposed to be doing. I know it's something else, huh? Yeah, it is. Are you going to explore the village tonight? Yeah, yeah, please. I'll take a stroll. It's about time I have a look around. I know Hittenberg, you've met a few people by now. Go have a look around, see if you run into any of them. It's not just that that a place like Hittenberg attracts a lot of people. You want normally normally meet. A lot of them will also help you out in many ways if you spend time with them. I've seen the big journal sticking out of your backpack. Give me that for a second, will you? There, I added some notes on different folks around here and how they might be helpful to you. Okay, so if we talk to him, he gives me an MP slot increase. She unlocks a character Capodium. Uh, uh, the dog helps me find a hidden dungeon. Danny gives me a HP slot. I get, tw good gosh, 20,000 Hinter bucks for him. Unlocks attack conduits, dodge stamina increase, rare attack conduit, emergency pager, better prices when selling items. Attack, dodge stamina, photo mode, MP slot increase, unlock combo counter, open lock treasure chest. Okay. Thanks. I'll have a look at those. Don't get me wrong, you should really hang out with whoever you find interesting. There's so many interesting people here, way more than you can fit in one, into one vacation. The notes are just there in case you ever, you're ever undecided or stuck. Do with them what you will. So my relationship with her has improved. You are now acquainted. You can now look at relationship perks that you get from hanging out with people. One more thing, the shops around here don't stay open all night. You should make sure you get your shopping done before you go out and party. There's a pharmacy down near Main Square. They're handing out free potions today. Here, let me mark it on your map. Okay, cool. I gotta run. Catch up again soon. Okay. Time passes when you are when you start activities such as going into the dungeon or hanging out with a fellow slayer. Always plan ahead for tomorrow's adventure and hit the shops before starting an evening activity. All right, let's just look around, see what we got going on here. What's the map? So we're right there. What is over here? A spa. There's old Travis. An evening in Hintonburg. There's the pharmacy. Cinema, Thea, vending machine, flowers and gifts, supermarket, souvenir shop. Okay. Let's, uh, new fast travel points. Oz Teresa. Let's go down to the shopping street. Let's get our free potions first. And the free potions over here. 
No, wrong way. I gotta take. I gotta go back. Down here to the right. What is what is the time? Unlock new fast travel point cinema. Before I start anything, I wanna get my potions first. And that were the uh, yeah. No. How do I get over there, bro? I'm going the wrong way. I need to go up here. What are these? This is flowers and gifts, vending machine. How do I buy new weapons? The vending machine, the HP snack. You got 4,000. I don't know. Inflation must have hit these guys too, because god dang it, I don't look like it's going to give me anything. What's in here? Sleeping mask? And what is this supposed to do? Where do you get like new gear and stuff at? Main square. This is where... Yeah, okay. That's where I can fast travel. Here's the... Finally. Give me some potions. I'll take a free potion. Uh, everything else we just have to leave alone. I'm still kind of broke. Find somewhere to find someone to spend the evening with. Who do I want to hang out with? There's. How do I look at the people that um. People. Who did I want to hang out with? Uh, Danny. Wherever Danny is. Okay, here's Danny. I'm gonna go there. Here's my gear. I think I just saw my gear. Let's go ahead and save. Alright. See, so here's my gear. Wait, hold on. So I've been had this the whole time? I didn't realize that. My body armor. What do I got? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Alright. Let's go, let's go to old Danny and them. I want to hang out with him. I can fast travel somewhere right here. Get out of the way, buddy. Can I fast travel? Ah, gear and more. That's where I want to go. Let's see if I turn this way. Okay, so we're straight ahead. So I need to go around this corner. If I want to get some of that, uh... Some of that nice gear. I want to buy some body armor. Let's see what we got. I got a summer sale armor. Okay, that's what I have. What's the most expensive one I can buy? Well, actually, we would probably... That gives me seven. Let's buy that. Yes, we we'll equip that. And then here's the legs. Let's buy the most expensive legs. We we'll equip that. Yeah. I can sell now, can I? Sell. Oh, I can't sell my own armor. Okay, got it. Now let's find old buddy to talk to because he's gonna give me health points if I get cool with them for a sure mission this place a campfire where adventures hang out and trade stories and tips it sounds like they're discussing difficulty levels of dungeons the shops are going to close soon do I have everything I need for tomorrow could I spend the e I could spend the evening here it might not be the right place to get it, to really get to know someone but hanging out at the campfire will slightly deepen my relationships with everyone there it will also slightly increase my renown relaxation and familiarity and amusement yeah. Look, each dungeon has a monster rating. They even put it up on the shiny little metal plate. So, of course, there's an order. Easy to hard. Warm up to main event. Why wouldn't I stick to that? Because we're here to explore. You've been at this for how many years now? 
You're a pro, you don't need a script. What about you, Nick Face? You doing a Dungeons in Order from Easy to Hard? Uh, probably. I don't mind following directions. I've only done the beginner's dungeon and one called Abandoned Mind Chef. I just got here yesterday. You did Abandoned Mind Chef? I've never been. What are you, for real? So how was it? Uh, my cart's in abyss. <laughs> Get ready to climb around bottomless pits a lot. Those cart rides, man, that's some serious speed. I often have a pretty easy time with dungeons that, often that others consider hard and vice versa why go according to the official numbers. You find a dungeon in the entrance spot, go inside even if you know you can't complete it yet. You're still going to learn something or find interest in loot. Enjoy your stay here, let us know how it goes. Was that it for that? Day two, night. Okay, there are four key ingredients to a good vacation in Hindenburg. Relaxation, amusement, and familiarity with the village, and your renown as a slayer. These social stats go up depending on how you spend your evenings. Your renown also increases whenever you complete a dungeon. <laughs> Excuse me. You're going to find that some people won't, won't want to hang out with you unless you're strong in a particular stat. Likewise, some of the weapons and armor you find will require you to reach a certain level in one stat or another to use them effectively. I'm welcomed back by the smell of heavy wood and unfamiliar brands of detergent. This room is starting to feel like home. Alright, we leveled up with her. My stuff went up 10. Rena went up 20. Sweet. I got new skills. I got 24. Did I just get this or... Monster slain. Can't wait to get in bed. Today was exhausting. Let's go ahead and go to bed then. I wonder if I just got 2,000. Like Stardew Valley where like after every day you get stuff if you like sell it or whatever. Nothing like a nice slow vacation breakfast even if it's as simple as buttered bread rolls. Hey, uh, do you mind if I sit with you for a minute? Sure. Just want to check in on you. I've been racking my brain over what happened the other day. Klaus seems really distressed. Where to have that moment with someone I used to watch on TV? Takes him a while to speak, and then he still doesn't quite know what to say. You know, three years ago when this whole thing started, I thought we were at the center of something big. Not nah, as in money or visitors, any of that. I remember when I first spotted what we call a monster. A whole new world opened up for us to explore. A year a short while later, we're funneling dozens of adventures in these strange new places every day. Dangers be damned. I wasn't keen on this job when the mayor offered it. I thought better than me than someone else. It's okay. I signed up for this. It wasn't your fault. I've been slipping. What happened to you was on my watch, on me. You got me out of there. I wouldn't have made it without you. Da, da, da. I'm glad you're all right, Luis. I really am. The earthquake left quite a mess behind, more than they'll admit to the public. Except for Dabrakovo, the dungeons are currently blocked off, but repairs are underway and they won't let their golden goose limp for long. Limp for long. Thanks for hearing me out. I have something for you if you're staying. It's an old emergency paper built to get a signal through an avalanche. Even gets through the magical interference around here. If you ever want to get out of a dungeon midway, use this. I'll have someone get you back to the village immediately. So now me and Claus are pretty cool. Come visit me down at Taurus Info sometime. It'd be nice to see how you're doing. Uh, do I have to go somewhere? I guess. Sure, let's go ahead and go here. I want to go ahead and save. Alright. Oh yeah, I've been to that dungeon too. Well, to the entrance part, where there's three doors and you have to cast the wrecking ball. I had to give up after that. I forgot the time and my shift was starting. Good thing I had one of these papers that can get you out of a dungeon. Getting back up that ladder would have been a pickle. There's a miner's window widow guy guarding the exit right. Did you counter her? Yeah. Then that's what they call the monster. But yeah, tough, huh? But yeah, tons of farms equipped to be her. Tons of what? What's a charm? You don't know about charms? Oh. 
They're magic trinkets. You carry them close to your heart, like in your backpack or in a fanny pack. Charms give you different powers. I get. I got one that creates a little explosion when I slay an enemy. My favorites are these two. Here, take them. I've got spears. Perfect dodge, slow down, physical attack boost. When you manage your equip charms, charms into your inventory. Charms get equipped into these nine slots of your stack. I'm getting additional slots later. So that perfect dodge charm from your. Uh, okay. We'll put it in there. And uh, move this to an empty one. Alright, awesome. You can now close this window. Your charms immediately take effect. Some people make a whole science out of charms. Me, I just try out whatever feels like fun or whatever gives my ex blows the extra oomph. So, you got a plan for which thing you're going to tackle today? Uh, I'll just explore. Ty, I can see what I can find. Well, that sounds like so much fun. If you do explore the mountains, just remember if, you, if an encounter is too tough, you can always go somewhere else and come back later. They've put up some signs to mark dangerous places, but I say just go with your instincts. I'll be at Kitty Land by the station. Stop by anytime if you want some pointers. Alright, I kind of want to check out. Is this what I came here for? Out here, it feels like Vienna is a million miles away. Just go explore. If I had danger, just find myself a sinking spot to tune out and let the afternoon go by. I can always ask my Rihanna. If I don't know where to go next. Let's go to the charms. Okay, so I got them. Oh, they take up. Oh, I thought I could equip nine of them. So they take up. I only have two more so I can get a, a second one. All right. I want to grab this stuff first. I saw it hiding in the corner. Go ahead and save the game. Saving a different spot so in case something gets corrupted. Uh, I'm gonna stop it right here, man. This game's pretty fun. Uh, pretty neat. It's got like you know, uh, the Souls-like style going for it, but it's not as hard, obviously. And um, I'm really enjoying the story, and the art style is something that really I really enjoy as well. I really like it. But I hope that you guys enjoyed the video, man. If you want more of it, let me know. If you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one, man. Peace.